Oh, yes. You guys have snitched on Slogo Man. That's right. I saw this comment in the comment section. Jelly, Slogo Man has been stealing from the wishing well. Like so Jelly can see. And this comment has 200 likes, so thank you guys so much for supporting Ryan on this one. But first, we gotta make sure that this is true. So this right here is the wishing well that I think Josh made in one of his videos. Now, I haven't actually watched that video, but there's something suspicious going on. Now I'm gonna go down to the bottom of it. If you guys remember, I actually threw down a lot of iron ingots, and I also stole a gift that Jordy got from Josh in his mailbox. He had like some, uh, some golden horse armor and iron ingots in here, and I also threw that down the well. Of course, thinking that it would disappear. But, apparently, something is going on. A according to Ryan, anyway. Oh, also, like and subscribe if you see this. You have to now. <laughs> That's right, bring this video to 100,000 likes. The previous one had only 80,000. Let's see if we can get more than 80,000 likes. And also, I only gained about 200 subscribers from the last video, so if I could gain 300 subscribers from this video, that'd be really helpful. Anyways, what's that down there? At the bottom of this well. Let's let's just should we just swim down? Maybe I should eat my bread first so I don't die. Okay. All right. There we go. Last piece. Now we're going to swim down. Woo! Um is this a bad idea? Okay. We've made it to the bottom of the well. So, what exactly are these things? Item hopper. What are these item hoppers doing here? What do they even do? And I'm drowning. I'm actually confused right now. Maybe I should dig it open! Dig it open! That's right, that's right. We're gonna dig you. We're gonna destroy you, little hopper. Three, two, one. Come on! Break! What exactly is this place? Let's just put a magma block down because... Ah, it's leaking. Where are we? We're below the well where we've got a little room and, like, a, a hallway? Um, okay. What's this? We've got a chest over here. All right, what's inside of this chest? Oh. My. God! Ryan! You are right! Thank you so much! Here we've got the golden horse armor, we've got the iron ingots, some seeds, some bone meal, and some other stuff. Are you kidding me right now? Josh has been stealing all of our stuff! Oh. My goodness. I don't know what to do at this point. Should we tell him? Should we tell Josh that we found this place? And then confront him about it? Because where even are we? Hello? Do I go through here? Uh... This is Josh's basement! Josh has a secret room in his basement and is stealing all of our stuff from the wishing well. Are you actually kidding me? He's using these hoppers because I think if you throw a piece of cobblestone in the whopper, then it'll go through it and arrive in the chest. Oh my goodness. I gotta be honest with you, Josh, this is an absolute genius idea. But... I'm on to you, mate. I'm on to you. All right, so I don't know what to do with this. We can break it so that he cannot steal anything anymore. Or wait a minute. We can troll Josh back. Oh my goodness, I've got such a great idea. What if we loop these hoppers to not feed Josh's chest, <laughs> but it feeds my chest? Where is my chest? Okay, let's go to my secret basement because I actually think I am super close to the well. All right, up Josh's house. Here we go. Now let's go down to my secret basement. That's not secret anymore. I'm still calling it a secret basement because that's what I named it, but everybody knows about it now. All right, I also fixed the hole down here. Obviously, um, yeah, this all blew up. Okay, so is this... Is this the well? Are you kidding me? These are the hoppers! This is absolutely perfect! Are you guys thinking about what I'm thinking? If we put a chest right over here, we will get all the stuff from the hoppers. But the problem is, if we put a chest there, I think Josh will be able to see it. We have to figure out a way to kind of steal all the stuff from the wishing well that Josh obviously thinks is going to him. And then we steal it. Ha! Huh. All right, so my idea is that we cover up these hoppers with another layer 
of hoppers. All right, let's go and get some iron. Do I have iron anywhere? I'm sorry, Bruno. I'm sorry. I haven't talked to you yet in this episode, and now he's staring into the wall. Bruno, it's gonna be fine, okay? I found something really important that I have to do. All right, so I currently have nine pieces of iron. Wait, do I, do I need chests for a hopper? I think I need chests for a hopper. Oh, wait, I still have some. All right, chest in the middle, hopper around it? No. You got two at the top and the sides and one at the bottom. And that's a hopper, but I don't think I've got enough for two. That's a bit awkward. Just open this up. It'll start leaking. But if we put an item hopper right around here that doesn't feed Josh's hoppers, but only feeds us, I think we might be able to do this. But clearly, first, we have to get some iron. And there we go. We've got our first piece of iron. Beautiful, looking great. Ooh, and our second. I'm not sure how many we need. I think we need at least like 25-ish. So let's just get a lot and then we'll head back home. All right, we've got some more over here. This is actually quite a lot. Finding iron in this game is pretty easy, luckily. So, oh, I got this. I got this done in no time. Look at that, guys. I've currently got 30 pieces in my inventory, and I'm not sure how much we need, but I think after this, we've probably got enough. This is way too easy. This is actually way too easy. Josh, you've made it too easy on me. All right, I've got 46 pieces of iron. I think it's about time to head back home. And here we are. Look how quick that was. It is still light outside even. Or we spend an entire night and it's, <laughs> it's just a new day. I have no idea. All right, so we've got two furnaces over here. Obviously, we're going to split this iron up to, uh, you know, make it go a little bit quicker. And there we go. Now, we have to wait. All right, our iron is done. We've got 50 pieces now, which is actually quite a lot. Now, we just got to make some hoppers. Um, I think we only need five. Now, we've got one already, so let's make four more. There we go, and five hoppers in my inventory. All right, so first things first, let's just make sure this water stops running down for a second, because it's so annoying. Now, we'll remove those later. We're going to make sure the water flows down, but I want to figure out if it's possible to just put the whoppers down like this, and then they don't feed the bottom ones. So if I put a sign... In this hopper, where does it go? Ah, come on! Okay, so that doesn't work. I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to put these hoppers even one block higher. Let's try that out. Okay, so what if we add them on this layer? There we go. Wait, hold up. It's working with this one, isn't it? Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> this is really tricky, guys. Okay, this is actually starting to work. I think, boom. Okay, wow, that doesn't look all that bad. So now I need to put these hoppers back that obviously feed Josh's chest. There we go, that seems to look okay. So if we now remove this block, and we add a nice hopper right over here. Okay, okay. We remove this torch, and we place a chest right over here. Will this work? All right, let's go upstairs. Let's just throw something into the well and see what happens. All right, let's have a look down here. Okay, you don't really see it. Obviously, it's a little bit elevated, but I don't even think Josh or Jordy have ever looked down this well. So I don't think they're going to notice. Let's throw some cobblestone down. Oh, and my axe. And see if this works. Come on. Give me everything. The moment of truth. The moment of truth. 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 Truth, of course. Here we go. Three, two, one. What? Why is that a thing? Ah. It's all stuck in this hopper. Okay, so it did catch everything. And it did deliver it to this hopper. But the problem is it didn't deliver it to the chest. Maybe we have to place it like this. Aha! Oh, see, now there's a little tube. Okay, let's do let's do that again. This time, I'll make sure not to throw my axe down or myself. <laughs> All right, into the hopper and a sign and a couple torches. Maybe one loaf of bread. All right, let's have a look. It's the moment of truth again. Here we go. Oh my goodness, it worked! It works. Okay, so we have successfully. Transformed Josh's 
hopper stealing mechanism and just turned it into my own. <laughs> All we got to do now is cover this up to make sure that Josh never finds this. And you know what? I actually think that's it. Now, they obviously know about this. They know about this secret room. So maybe, maybe we should just cover it up. I don't know. It might be good to, uh, to cover it up for now. All right, we'll put a torch on there so we know it's right behind that piece of cobble. <laughs> now, please, ladies and gentlemen, do not snitch on me. Do not tell Cobble Cop or Slogan Man that I built this, all right? Josh clearly knew what he was doing, so now we just gotta, you know, give him some payback and give me some, some free loot. Thank you. All right, so the last thing we gotta do is remove these signs. That's right. It's very important that we do that. Now the water is flowing and nobody will know that I ever did this. Bruno, I've successfully trolled Slogo man. He is gonna fall for it like crazy. And of course, Rubble Cop as well. I'm proud of you, Bruno. I'm very proud of you. Now, before we end this episode, I want to gift both Quibble Cop and Slogoman something nice. That's right, Quibble Cop is going to get a piece of string, and Slogoman is going to get a nice piece of flint. How nice. He's going to love that. Oh, here you go, Quibble Cop. And obviously, we must not forget that our boy Ryan has officially successfully snitched on Slogoman. Thank you, Ryan. This right here is going to be Ryan. Watch this. Colin Rose doing some action. Boom! That's Ryan right there. What's up, Ryan? How's it going? You're so cute. That's right, Ryan. You're getting your own beautiful sign. Ryan, uh, the wish? The wish. You're the wish, Ryan. My wish came true. Clearly, we're going to have to extend my house because we're running out of place for a sign. But please, snitch on Slogoman, snitch on Quibble Cup, whatever they are doing, leave it in the comment section down below because I really need to find out. Chickens, I will see you in the next one. Bye! Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, click on that subscribe button and also make sure to check out the new exclusive Jelly Army t-shirts on jellystore.com.